and give us your views on how the market fared today. Well, stocks were slightly up today. This is the first time we've seen a turnaround in what has been a very long bear run. In fact, since we got into the second half of 2011, the stock market, the index has lost about 600 points. Mm. Market capitalization is down. But today we saw the smallest of rallies. It's below 1%, 0.66. So that shows that maybe people are beginning to see that with the levels of stock prices now, mm. there's some value to be gained by going into equities as opposed to the continuous investments right. in fixed income securities that we've been witnessing. I mean, could be many experts say that, you know what, the market will continue to be a little bit sideways up until September when we have absolute clarity on what's happening with the recapitalization of rescued banks. And so in many ways, the bank's going to be the determinants of the market going forward. Do you concur? Well, to a very large extent, that is correct. Because when you look at the top stocks on any given day, they tend to be tends to be the banking sector that moves the market. We have a couple of manufacturing companies as well that have quite a lot of impact, but generally it is the banking stocks. And it is for the most part the banking stocks that have been losing value for you know for most of this mm. year. So yes, I agree with that. And from what we've been seeing playing out on the fundamentals of the market, that seems to be correct. I mean, let's talk about um, June inflation figures that came out at 10.2%. So it's a good figure. MPC next week, a stronger NARA. All these events uh, considered. How do you think the CBN will rule? Well, again, analysts are speculating on that. Like you said, there's been a lot of stability. I think what can best define July is stable. Interest rates, yes, they've been declining, but they've declined within a range of maybe 200 basis points for Treasury bills. Um, the exchange rates have been range bound at about 152. There's been a convergence in the official window between what the central bank is offering mm -hmm. and what is happening interbank. So, um, but right now, analysts are just expecting that there might be a slight pickup of rates at the MPC meeting based on the fact that we're still facing right. inflationary pressures and inflation is something that the central bank wants to keep in single digits for the rest of this year. I mean the rally we've seen on the currency could be, do you expect that to continue? Because obviously together with a series of reforms for the Bureau de Change, for foreign ownership of government treasuries, there is a sense that capital inflows should start really flowing into Nigeria. I mean any indications uh, from the uh, debt management office auctions coming through does that tell you what sort of trends we're likely to see going forward the Lerato, in terms of the foreign investments they've been coming in for a while they've been coming in since the end of the elections and that is what uh, that that's what has accounted for yes a bit of stability in the currency and also the fact that there's been quite a lot of appetite for fixed income securities we expect that to continue. We've seen a, little, a lot of it so far. But one thing that could change is the fact that with restrictions on the length of time um, foreign money has to stay in the country, it's now 91 days. Mm. We've also seen more interest at the short end. So the question is this, will those short end flows go out before the end of the year or not? If they do, there might be some pressure on the currency towards September, October. We might see that or just before the year end, which is like a six months period. That could happen. But again, it all depends on the stability of policies, if any major change comes out again from the NPC meeting, those are the factors that we're considering. But yes, there's been quite a lot of support um, for, the, for the Naira in the last, at least since the beginning of the second half of the year. 